Nyambura and welcome to my channel and if you're coming back thank you thank you for clicking the video so for this week I'm doing five outfits inspired by my favorite to cartoons growing up they're like Kim Possible and Adventures of Jackie Chan and that kind of thing and I really had fun with this I I really enjoyed like challenging myself and finding things in my closet that fit the the character but trying not to make it as like costumey because this i wanted this not to be like a cosplay but more of like an inspiration so if you want a cosplay kind of thing i would be happy to do that but for this video we're doing very realistic outfits and yeah i'll see you at the end of the video cue the music i got my head out the sunroof i'm blasting my favorite tunes i only got For the first day, I went with Ashley B from the Ashley Squad in recess. Loki, I always wanted to be part of the Ashleys, but my name is it Ashley. The weather was horrible this day, that's why I chose like pants and a cardigan. I actually don't even have a yellow skirt, but yeah, so this is what it looks like. I tucked one of the sides in because her cardigan is a little bit cropped and mine isn't. I also paired it with this gold necklace and dainty gold earrings and had my hair in like bantu not out because her hair is curly as well and then i went with this black boots in place of her black mary jeans because i don't have those and then i paired it with this black bag and a black belt to pull the look together and i really think that it's so cute it's so fun and i kept my makeup really really simple because she was in elementary so not much makeup was on there For the second day, I went with Jackie Chan from The Adventures of Jackie Chan. I loved that cartoon so much. I watched it every single week coming home from school and I just had to recreate it. If you watched my last thrift flip or rather thrift haul video, you would have seen these pants that I got for 100 bob, I think twice. And I think it's so comfortable. I would actually fight in this if I could actually fight, but I can't. So yeah, this is my outfit for Jackie Chan. I was spending my entire day at home this day, so I didn't really dress up or put on much jewelry and makeup. So yeah, this is me as Jackie Chan, but I did my nails though. I did my nails and I got my hair done this day. So yeah, that's what I did that day. I also put on this hoodie much later because it got colder. But all in all, this outfit was so comfortable. 10 out of 10 would recommend. Tell me I'm not the only one who was obsessed with fairy odd parents. And Trixie was one of my favorite characters just because of how they dressed her. She was always so cute. And so for her outfit, I made this headband from scratch because I did not have a headband. And I made it from scrap material. And then I included these white pants instead of a skirt that she wore. I don't actually own a tennis white skirt, so I thought it would be better with pants and then I went with these pearl earrings and for makeup because Trixie is one of the cartoon characters that actually have makeup on I went with a purple eyeshadow and strong eyebrows and eyeliner because she has eyeliner on the, on the show as well and for her shoes I went with these white sneakers because this is something that I would actually wear to school I actually ended up wearing this whole outfit with the bag to school and so this is how the makeup turned out along with the hair and the headband and this is the whole outfit 
it is so cute so comfortable i don't believe i never thought of wearing these together i need somebody to adore me uh, i'm here okay <laughs> Juniper Lee is one of those cartoons that I watched when I was a kid and then I forgot that I ever watched it and shame on me that was such a good show so to recreate this I went with these dark wash pair of jeans they do have like a white denim panel at the bottom but they'll work because they're the only de dark denim jeans I have and for the t-shirt I didn't have an exact one but I had this like drawstring kind of Y2K vibe t-shirt and I thought it would be good because it could actually be cropped and for Juniper I'm also doing a little bit of makeup as well because she does have that like iconic top lip or that cartoon characters have and a little bit of an eyeliner June's hair was always parted down the middle and it stayed that way but braids don't work like that so I put on this headband, this black headband just so my hair could stay and then when I got my hair done this week I had the hairdresser do all maroon braids at the back so that I could match that little like streak of maroon Juniper had and for shoes I'm wearing my slides because I'm going to be home all day but if I was leaving I'd wear these like beige shoes because they kind of match the ones Juniper wear But this outfit is so cute, it's so comfortable and I feel like a character in an early 2000s movie. And for jewelry, I put on like very dainty pieces because she doesn't have any jewelry on the show. This is hands down my favorite outfit this entire week. It might not be like the most put together but it was so comfortable and so creative and I really liked it. If you know me in person, you've probably heard my Kim Possible message tone because Kim Possible is all I wanted to be when I grew up. So yeah, this is my favorite, favorite thing that I have actually done on my channel is dressing like Kim Possible. <laughs> so I, I actually curled my hair for no reason at all because Kim's hair is not curled. But yeah, I, I curled my braids just for a little change and change my nails. And for makeup, I did that like iconic like brown top lip that she had and the side part of her hair. And for my outfit, I'm wearing these cargo pants that I thrifted like two weeks ago, I think, for 10 bob. 10, sh I, yeah. I paired it with this black mock neck top. And I really like this outfit. It's imitating the outfit she'd wear in, on her missions. And her top is initially cropped, but it was way too cold this day to wear anything cropped. And I would have worn the black boots that I wore on Monday had I been going anywhere. But I spent the day at home, so there was no need to wear shoes inside the house. So that's it for today's video. I really hope you liked it. I hope you enjoyed it. And yeah, so I'll see you in my next video with maybe more outfits if you want some more please comment down below comment down below which ones were your favorite ones which ones you're going to recreate if you plan on recreating any of them and i'll see you next week you say you're gonna pull up but i know you only come if you think that makes us even